my grandpa would always boss my grandma around. Go get me this, go do that, go do this, go do that. It riled me up so bad, especially as I was a young feminist, I would get so mad at him. At a certain point, I asked my grandma about it and she was like, I love it. This is part of our relationship. It feels really good to me. And I had to take a beat and go, oh, right. Not only are they from a completely different time period, they had different agreements in their relationship, even though that didn't work for Mary. And even though once I found out she loved it, it was still hard for me to hear him boss her around. And I had to be like, that's cool. That's their relationship. This isn't me. It's not my ball game to referee over there. And often a lot of this is about you being the referee between like your mom, your mom and your sister, your mom and this person, your mom and that person. And I want to encourage you to fire yourself from the referee. Who gives a shit if your mom told you your sister's feelings were hurt? You can call up your sister. Hey, I don't know if your feelings are hurt, but if they are, I love you and I'm sorry or not. That means to you, but really as much as possible when we have someone in our lives who thrives on creating divisive scenarios, we want to extricate ourselves from the middle of that as much as possible.